Well, okay. Test recording number one. We're gonna make a new character. Hardcore. Naughty Norman. Classic name. Um, got a little character prepared for this. There we are. Naughty Norman will, of course, live in your backyard. Marshmallow Crimson, unseated. Here we go. Sunflowers. <gasps> That's a great start. It's basically the best thing that can happen off the bat. Gold coin from a tree. Means I want to make housing real fast, so I get the merchant, can buy some shurikens. Avoid dying. Um, it's the fastest way to make a house. We want it to be at spawn as well, so that when we recall we don't die. We're in the safe zone. Normally wouldn't cut down tiny trees like this, but I want a house quick. I think this might be big enough. Yeah, this is big enough. So that'll be guide house, and then we'll get merchant house just here. Terrible housing. But I tend not to make sky housing until. Till I've got a bed. To the tall trees. I'm not entirely convinced this is an optimal way to start, but you know, housing is useful at all points, like this house will be useful throughout the game. I'll never replace it because there's NPCs that I just want to shove somewhere. No torches yet. Oh, the guide's gonna die. Damn it. Give me gel. This is horrific. The 
guide would make this so much faster. This is the problem I always encounter building a house at spawn. The guide doesn't get in the house, or like, well, I guess I didn't make a door for him. Maybe I need to make a door on the first, on the ground floor, just so the guy can get in, and then I remove it so he can't then get back out and let enemies in. Ourselves a bit less squishy, I guess. Wow, that's the wrong choice of armor. The legs give you nothing. Basically just one gold. Um, could sell some mushrooms. Let's get our wood back. Yeah, I'm gonna go for doubling my inventory size. And an anvil. And a bug net in case there's a gold animal. And then a potion. Hardly worth getting eleven shurikens, but <laughs> I'm gonna do it anyway. Ooh. I think this is worth. It might only be like five silver actually. Yeah, it was like six silver. Um, if I can buy more shurikens now. I'll kill annoying things. <laughs> Weird cobwebs on the surface. Starting item. Uh, recall potions are big. Oh, grenades are big. Get the demo man right off. Shouldn't have bought these shurikens. Grenades. Grenades are all you need. I swear Night Owl Potion is the most useless potion in the game. Okay, Recall Potions go on my most accessible slot. So I'm at risk now of going too slow and getting stuck at spawn overnight. 
which will really slow down my whole run. But there are chests in here. The umbrella is, I think, a pretty bad weapon. Dead end. Mm, worth grabbing this for a bed or obsidian armor. Feel free to interrupt me, by the way, Eleanor. <laughs> Don't think that you can't talk to me. <laughs> I'm, ju I'm just fucking around, honestly. Cool. Oh no. I always feel this is a waste of time, but cheap bombs. Cheap bombs are so good. Oh, is it worth it? Or is it a big waste of time? I mean, nades are so good and making them cheaper. I think I just just buy them. In exchange for a squirrel. Nades for squirrels. A special service. Alright. Let's do something stupid. We have recall potions. If I didn't have recall potions, I'd probably stay at home and just try and dig a elevator, or at least down to where I can build a house for the demolitionist. Make it underground. Yeah. Uh, yes. Yes, it's there. Sorry, I hid it. Mouse matters. Sorry. 